right, everyone, welcome back to Miss Cheryl's Place. Today, I'm coming to you with a co-hosted collaboration. That's right, I am co-hosting this collaboration with Craft Today with Rita Renee. Now, check this out. Here's the thing. You guys know that we did our open invite, and I hope you guys are going to participate in full bloom. What I have come up with is a tablescape. If you'd like to hear about what it is that I did in regards to this tablescape, stay tuned. All right, guys, so what it is, is, is that it was an open invitation, as I stated, from Craft Today with Rita Renee and myself, and we asked that you guys come along with us and do something that was fall related. It could have been a tablescape. You could have baked a spice cake, a banana nut bread. You could have done a home tour. You could have done a DIY. We left it up to you, the creator, to do what you felt you could do in this time of fall. So, with that being said, I'm gonna bring you guys a little bit closer so that you can see what it is that I came up with. All right, guys, so here's my tablescape here. And what I did was I pulled out some chair covers that I have had since 2010. And I absolutely love anything Buffalo check, anything that is, this is more of a gingham, but the table runner is a Buffalo as you see, but the gingham pattern reminded me of Buffalo check. So that is the reason why I use that chair slip cover and I purchased them 10 years ago. There are four of the plaid ones or the uh, gingham patterns. And then there are four of these that have sayings on them. This one, as you can see, says family. The other one on the other side says share. Inside of my tablescape, let's get into this. I use my Buffalo check piece of material that I purchased from Walmart, which by the way, I'm having a hard time finding at Walmart again. Hopefully they'll bring it back. Or I will just check other Walmarts. I took my table and I can of cornered the table to start with. So that's what angle, it's not your video eyes, it's not your camera, it's not your um, computer, it's not your laptop. It literally is cat-cornered. I can cornered it on an angle. Then I took the table runner or piece of material and did the exact same thing. I turned it on an angle. So as you can see, it's not straight on the table, it's an angle. Then I have my bows that I hauled from Sam's Club and I will post that video for you or either in the description box or in an iCard. I have my black saucer on this setting in a white plate right along with a black glass. Now, for some reason I couldn't find my other dish towel that I got from the Dollar Tree and used to put on top of this setting. Okay, so I purchased those bowls from Sam's Club. The black saucer is a Dollar Tree find. The white plate is also Dollar Tree and the dish towel is Dollar Tree. Now, I also purchased this item here in the center of my table and I will once again either leave a link in the description or I will put it on an iPod. I'm gonna take these black pumpkins out that I painted myself so that you can see what it says. It says country life, fresh farm, and premium quality. Absolutely love this uh, piece. It is galvanized on the outside. It has wood handles um, and I absolutely love it. I will once again put an eye card up. The plate in the back, it's called uh, red label is what it says and it says poultry feed. Love it. I'm gonna tell you something. I got those from Cracker Barrel about five years ago and have not used them. I have four of them and I have not used them, but I have an idea of what I'm gonna do with them for the summer next year. And I can't, of course, because they came from Cracker Barrel, buy any more. Unless another Cracker Barrel brings them out and it was off base when they did it. So on the other side of that, I have the platter or the plate as I said. And then I have a rooster here on the thing. I have a candle there in the jar. My salt and pepper shakers, as well as these being salt and pepper shakers, the pumpkin and the board are salt and pepper shakers. So here's the other side of the thing. Tablescape, you guys. And as I said, this one says share. 
And then we go this way. So, at the end of that, this is the end of my tablescape. And I don't want to say the end of my videos. I'd like to also thank my co-host, Miss uh, Rita from Craft Today with Rita Renee. She has been such a joy to do collaborations with. And I really appreciate her uh, doing this collaboration with me as well. She has been a good friend and, uh, excuse me, and I really appreciate her. I also want to say and take time out to thank all of my subscribers that are participating. I'd like to thank all of you guys for supporting me. To all of my new subscribers, you are the best. You are great. I absolutely love you guys. And I really, really, truly, from the bottom of my heart, soul, and spirit, appreciate you. So, till the next time, see you in the next video.